is up you guys good morning welcome to another video cheers to you guys cheers to my boys so today I'm at home and I'm gonna be working on uh, my personal car it's a 2002 Dodge Neon the problem with it is it's an intermittent issue sometimes as I'm driving down the road I'll be going like 40 and then I don't know we'll just hit zero fucking pop my head forward break my neck a little bit and then after that I, get, I guess it goes into like limp mode and it won't shift past first gear I want to see if I can duplicate it because it doesn't happen all the times sometimes it'll happen in the morning as soon as I take off and sometimes I'll drive it for like a week and the fucking problems never there so I want to see if I can get it to act up right now I'm gonna go drive it I gotta take a little trip to the home day pot if it doesn't act up if it acts up, it's gonna be a diagnostic video. If it doesn't act up, it's gonna be a tool haul video. So stick around and let's hope something happens. All right, we're in the car. We're gonna start it up. I got the little homie Omar in the back. You ready, Omar? He's ready. Two hours later. Alright guys, so it ends up being a tow haul because the car wasn't acting up but I got a lot of pretty good stuff. First of all, I got a shipment from Amazon then we took a little trip to the Home Depot and then we went to Harbor Freight. So this is going to be Harbor Freight, Home Depot and a little bit of Amazon all in one video. So first things first, uh, I did a blower motor video so I had the little ratchet and the air hose and it's just a hassle carrying that thing around so I decided I was going to invest a little bit of money into this Milwaukee M12 cordless ratchet. Now I know you guys seen a couple of these already, you guys seen a bunch of reviews on these, but the thing for me is when a tool like this comes out, I don't go right away and buy it. I, I wait for the reviews, I wait for people to see if it's good or bad. It's like when the first one came out, I didn't go and went, I didn't go and I didn't go by the first generation because I know that there's always, they always make a newer, better version of the tool, and this is what it is. So let's go ahead and open this up. Now this right here is the tool only, it doesn't come with batteries. All right, this is just the tool, but I've heard a lot of good things about this. Now, I was considering getting a snap-on cordless ratchet but the thing about snap-on is it's too pricey I mean the quality is good for snap-on but the price is just too high I was even considering the Harbor Freight earthquake cordless ratchet but I think the quality on that one is pretty low but the price is good it's a good price quality low snap-on high price good quality so I guess you can call this a middle of the road tool but honesty Milwaukee has been killing the game lately with these cordless tools. This right here is just a tool, all right? It has no batteries. So I went ahead and I got myself a pair of batteries. Now I got two so that I don't have to keep waiting for this to charge. And uh, eventually if I get another tool, I already have extra batteries for it. And I already have a charger because I got the Milwaukee Impact and I also got a Milwaukee Drill. So the charger is already there. I just needed the batteries and now I got a cordless tool. Now I'm not saying I'm gonna stop using air tools. Air, air tools are good, but every tool has its time and its place. And um, it's, it's just a hassle. And sometimes the, sometimes the air tools, sometimes the air hoses don't work, you know, for whatever reason. You need to have backup things. I mean, Milwaukee, I can't complain. I've heard nothing but good things about them. Oh, it even has a little safety switch. Nice. Look at that. So, this right here is like 150 bucks. Plus another 50 bucks for the two batteries. Now, I got this from Home Depot. I always go to the same Home Depot. So any problems that I have with this, this right here, any problems, I go back. Plus, it already comes with a, comes with a five year warranty. So, any problems, I'm pretty sure that Milwaukee's gonna take care of it. And I also got this little Milwaukee drill for my impact. 
sometimes you got, you're gonna need that long reach so this right here was like five bucks I would recommend that you get one of these for one of these I also got myself some PB blaster because sometimes WD-40 starts disappearing around the shop you know what I'm saying so I got some PB blaster uh, it's the cheapest one they had it was like three or four bucks I'm gonna keep this in my box hopefully this doesn't disappear you know what I'm saying and one more thing from Home Depot Loctite. Actually, it's not Loctite, it's super glue. A lot of times we break shit and you don't have any super glue, keep it in hand. You never know when you're gonna break something. So that's that. Then, so I actually went to Amazon and I ordered one of these lights. This right here is the Astronomatic 30SL. This is a rechargeable, flexible light. Okay? Now I got this one because of its flexibility it has a dimmer so you can choose your brightness and um, it's rechargeable with a micro USB just like you have on some of your phones so there it is rechargeable with a micro USB and uh, magnetic this right here will run you about 40 bucks from Amazon and it's an astronomatic so it's a good buy and you can stick this anywhere on the car magnetic right any on any steel surface and you can point it any which way you want you can control the the brightness and it, it overall I think it's gonna be a good tool Astro I've heard nothing but good things so we'll see how this turns out when I got that when I ordered that in the mail I got I got an email from Harbor Freight saying that they had some big tool sales or whatever and I found this one on Harbor Freight's website. This one retails about 35 bucks, but they had a coupon that can drop the price to about 20 bucks. I already opened this. This one also has a magnet on the bottom and it flexes so you can point it in any direction that you want. This one just has an on off switch. All right, and then it has a little light at the end. I think you guys seen a bunch of reviews on this. Um, the only complaint that I've seen is that this little shit right here breaks, but get this for 20 bucks with the coupon, then that money that you saved, invest it into the tool warranty. Uh, it comes with a 90 day warranty, but you add a, a one year warranty on top of this. So this is a Braun Light, 360, sorry, 390 lumens. This one is the Astro, 300 lumens. So they're about the same brightness and what the thing about the reason I also got this is because it also charges with the micro USB there on the bottom so these both of these lights use the same charger they both have magnets on the bottom they're both flexible you can point them in any direction that you want so these two I'm gonna use them at work I'm gonna compare them see which one lasts longer which one which one does better and then see how it goes so I got some lights cordless ratchet some PP blaster this is a Home Depot Harbor Freight slash Amazon tow haul um, I'm not sure how much I spent but I, I, I still am looking at some more Harbor Freight uh, things uh, I don't recommend Harbor Freight for everything only a couple things but um, that's my Home Depot Harbor Freight tow haul hope you guys like it if you do leave a comment below don't forget to subscribe to the channel let me know what you guys think and give the video a like that's it homies, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.